Being and living the love you are, class seven, love and relationships. Hello, I'm Jim Morningstar. This is class seven of being and living the love you are, love and relationships. In this class, we will address love and our relationships from their origins to their completion. How we develop as relational beings, the languages of love, and how we communicate clearly identifying our familiar relationship patterns, and coming to fulfillment with our beloved on the highest level. We will engage in practices of forgiveness, building holy relationships, and the advanced art of laughing at ourselves. Let us set the tone of our relational work by summoning our ideal male and female selves into perfect union with an opening meditation. Get yourself in a comfortable seated position with your spine relatively straight and gently let your eyes close. Focusing your attention at the base of your spine, on your inhale, bring the energy up your back to the top of your head as though a loving hand was massaging your energy field, sending healing and soothing vibrations to each vertebrae on the way up. Then, as you exhale, let your breath come down the front of your body, again sending loving and healing energy to every vital organ on the way down. Keep the cycle of breath going easily without pause, relaxing more and more into the circle of loving and protecting energy being created by your breath and your intention. Let yourself feel tended to in such a way that the energy you bring in goes to the right places most needed in your body, even though at the time you may be unaware of where these are. It's okay to have a slightly floaty feeling, as though you were being transported to another dimension. As you keep your attention on the breath going up your back and down your front. Now bring your attention to your heart area in the center of your sacred circle and invite images and or a felt sense of your perfected male and perfected female selves into your heart. Release your mind from having to control or even understand who these beings are and just trust your intuition to give you either the images or felt sense or both of beings that represent parts of you that you may have not fully yet realized. See these perfect male and perfect female parts of yourself begin to explore their relationship unfettered by external judgments or fears. See them playing in nature with delight, sharing their wonder and joy with innocence and enthusiasm, perhaps running through tall grasses on a summer's day, sitting in the shade of a grand tree, wading in a mountain brook, or diving in the waves of the sea. Whatever comes to you as enjoying harmony and sensing and sharing. See them coming together and holding each other in pure love and rapture. Know that these are parts of yourself that have longed to find each other, perhaps catching glimpse of the other through lifetimes of relationships. Imagine how it feels to finally embrace and know that their search has ended and a new life of fulfillment can now be experienced the waves of which will be felt in all the activities, experiences, and outside relationships in which you will engage henceforward. As a symbol of inclusiveness of this inner love affair, 
with your outside world, let the energy of your perfected male travel from your heart out your right arm and the energy of your perfected female travel from your heart down your left arm. Let them reach out to the world in front of you, sending love to all who are in your life. Then bring the palms of your hands together in a prayer position. Again, reuniting your male and female selves in your outer world. This is a higher meaning of prayer in which divine male and divine female are joined in perfect equality and harmony in your heart and manifesting in your world. It is from this union that comes the fulfillment of your deepest desires and your highest aspirations beyond what your ego mind has capacity to understand, but which the simplicity of your divine inner child knows intimately. You are the product of this loving union. And we all are here to help each other remember and live in this sacred space. Affirming that this is so, let yourself, with a few deep and clearing breaths, come back and open your eyes with a willingness to more and more operate from an experience of your inner completion and ability to radiate this and all your relationships in the world.